the keywords with Group Shield. If you go to Policy Manager and Shared Resource on the Filter Rubes tab, Create New. And I'm going to give this one a sensible name so I know what it is Blocked Words. There is selected up there. I want to create a new rule. Right, I'm going to give the name a rule. Blocked keywords. And a brief description, although it's self explanatory, what the rule is doing. Tick the box to add this rule to the categories rule group. And here's the word I'm going to block. Because this is a production environment, I don't want impacts on the users that are using it. Ignore the case so it can be a mixture of upper and lower case. Uh, if you had uh, extra words like you wanted to block watch only if it was with Rolex, you could put that in there by taking that box. Now select the file format tab. Untick everything and select email messages. All. So if it's in the header, the subject line, or the body, etc., it'll still get picked up. Now you need to save that. And with all things group shields, you need to go up to the top and apply it. So it'll go green. Now we need to add that to the scanner. So select On Access, Master Policy, and the bit of the policy we're looking for is Content Scanning. Select that, add rule, change it to your blocked words category. Now I've only got one at the moment, but I'm going to have multiples in the future. So I'm going to select all. I'll replace with alert, I'll log, or quarantine, I'll notify both the sender and receiver. You might want to do this in a production environment, but that's what I'm going to do. Once again we need to save that and because there's been a change made we need to apply the policy once again. Smashing. Okay, let's test that. Just minimize that out of the way. As you can see, I'm on Exchange 2003. Well, it's an SBS 2003 box, actually. I'm going to send a test email to my work account. With me blocked Kajagoogoo word in. Not that I've got anything against Kajagoogoo, but I doubt it'll be in any legitimate traffic going through this mail server today. Send. Now I'll have to go through the inspection and scanning engine, etc. So it'll take a few seconds. But hopefully, there we go. Then we can see that McAfee Group Shield has blocked the email under the block words category. That's great until you want to add another word on. To do that, I've got a policy manager, shared resource, make sure filter rules is selected. There's the one we created earlier, so I click Edit, click Edit again, and now we can add a new phrase. Remember, you put these in as phrases, so like I said, you can block, you can block Watch if it comes on with Rolex, etc. I'll block the word of Wimble, because I don't have, we don't have any nuns working here, so... Apply, and then that'll be blocked also, and you can build that up with sensible words like Viagra and Rolex watches etc. Don't forget to visit us at www.peatnetlife.com. Thanks very much for watching.